Hello fashion sewers. In today's video tutorial I'm going to show you how to make belt thread loops. I'm Colleen Geely and this is Fashion Sewing Blog TV. Here's an example of a belt thread loop. It's made from thread and it is designed to hold the belt in place and it's also there to be discreet. I'm going to show you how to make your own uh, thread loop with this small example here. This is going to represent the side seam of my garment because that's where you'll find most of the thread loops. The first thing you need to do is thread your needle and you need to make sure it's double threaded. So you've got four, four th strands of thread and also not the end. Now working from the wrong side of your garment, put a needle through the seam, pull it through until it stops. Pick up a couple of thread, a bit of your fabric, like so, and you're going to create a loop. The next thing you need to do, make sure you get a loop that's kind of comfortable where you can fit about three fingers through, and then you're going to collect the thread, bring it through, tighten it down at the bottom but still have a loop. So you're bringing your thread through the loop to create another loop. Bring your thread through, create a loop. Bring the thread through, create another loop. So this is what you effectively is a chain stitch. So I'm going to keep on going. It's very quick and easy to do. It's very effective. It's quite therapeutic really. So just keep going and keep going and I'm going to continue this and I'll come back to you once I've got my length that I want. I now got it to my desired length that I need and as you can see that is what is called a chain stitch and it's very strong. The next thing to do is to knot this end and all you do is just bring your needle through the loop And secure the end and the end is now secure and then you position it back into the seam to a position that you're happy with you want a bit of ease in there you don't want it to be totally flat against the garment so you want yeah that's a good spacing that you'll need and then turn your work to the back just do a little stitch going to do one more and then I'm going to then knot it off, tie a knot and then cut and there is your belt thread loop. Well I hope you found that video tutorial helpful. Thread loops are a great way of holding those belts in position while remaining discreet. If you have any questions or queries please put me in the comment box below and I'll see you next time.